When we met her, it was her very first time being out of the lab. It is her first time touching grass. They've never been outside. And so for her, we were able to be there from that first moment, which was really important to us. Her paw, you know, had been shaved and where it was aggravated from repeated needle being put in her there. There were scar marks. It was clear that they've had babies. But other than that, we'll never know exactly what was done. You can see her tattoo is on her ear. She's so loving and she's so loyal. All of the fear that she carried around with her and knowing that it came as a result of testing for whatever reasons. It's heartbreaking. <laughs> the first year or so that she was home, we thought her vocal cords had been cut. She never made noise and we didn't know that she knew how to bark or make noise. The longer she's been home, the more comfortable she feels. So, Gertie came home a year after Franny. Hey, Gertie. The thing that's interesting, though, is they were at the exact same lab, but their personalities are so different. Franny was really skittish with our daughter at first when she came home and was a little nervous about this new little toddler. Gertie is amazing with kids and, and likes to play fetch and run around and let a kid pet her. Good girl, Gertie. Our son is blind, uh, the son that we adopted from China, and when he first arrived home, he would lay in the dog bed with Gertie and hug Gertie, and he loves feeling her. <laughs> as long as humans were around, Gertie was instantly comfortable. Everyone gets along, but that being said, Franny, the longer she's home, the more territorial she has become. She's found her voice, and it comes out when she's chasing our cats. <laughs> which you would never expect because she seems so timid. It just changed the way that we looked at products and the way that we shop and where we choose to spend our money. Beagles are most often tested on because of their nature and their personality, because they're such gentle dogs. Even when they are being taken advantage of or being hurt, they're forgiving, and so, and, and they don't often fight back or bite back because they are so gentle. It's worth it because every day you come home and she just can't wait to climb on your lap, and she's the most loyal dog ever.